Eternal 76 will play host to a potential history-making featherweight title fight as current bantamweight champion Rod Costa looks to become the promotion's first simultaneous two-division champion when he takes on the reigning featherweight king in Justin Lockjaw Van Heerden. Eternal 76 will mark the second time that Justin and Rod have shared the Eternal cage together. The pair's first fight at Eternal 60 saw Rod Costa secure a first round TKO victory in a violent showing of Rod's drastically improved striking skills. The setback suffered by Justin in their first meeting would then see a rejuvenated lockjaw go on a four fight win streak which culminated in a title winning performance as he outclassed Diego Pereira over five rounds at Eternal 72 to be crowned the Eternal Featherweight Champion. As a pressure wrestler with deceptively powerful boxing, Justin's style can best be described as relentless. It doesn't matter whether you defend the first, the second, or even the third takedown, Justin will continue to shoot and drown you with a physicality and pace that very few can stop. As a dynamic submission threat with elite positional control, Rod Costa is at the very top of the list when it comes to the best pound-for-pound -pound grapplers on the Eternal roster. Fresh off back-to-back -back submission victories over Sean Etchell and Michael Manu, Rod's recent performances have shown significant improvements in his striking combined with his now infamous world-class grappling skills. If Rod is able to land some heavy shots on the feet and force Justin to shoot from a vulnerable position, Rod can then look to either lock up a fight ending submission or reverse the takedown attempt and find himself in a dominant grappling position. As of late, we've seen Justin have so much success with that suffocating fence wrestling and heavy top pressure. If Justin elects to employ a similar game plan against Rod, he will need to look to settle in positions that minimize the submission threat, all while being incredibly conscious of his neck during the wrestling exchanges. Once securing those positions, Justin will look to blend control and strikes in order to completely nullify Rod's game. As we prepare to lock the Eternal Cage door behind Justin Van Heerden and Rod Costa for a second time inside the HBF Stadium in Perth, will current featherweight champ Justin Van Heerden claim his long-awaited redemption or will Rod Costa make history as Eternal's first simultaneous two-division champion? We'll find out when it all goes down, live and exclusive on UFC Fight Pass.